Now, President Museveni's government has responded to the Archbishop of the Catholic Church, that is Paul Semogerede, about the poison scare in the country. Subscribe to the Buzz UG in case you haven't, and also tap on the bell for all the notifications. Now, on Sunday, the Archbishop of the Catholic Church, that is Paul Semogerede, said no one should stop Ugandans from talking about the poison scare in the country. Now, his statement came after President Museveni had directed that Uganda police should arrest everyone who is claiming that Jacob Olanya was poisoned. But the Archbishop said, no, 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 no. You cannot stop people from talking about something that is about to claim their lives. <laughs> Now, government through the state minister of national guidance, that is Godfrey Kabianga, has responded to the Archbishop Paul Semogerede. Now, this minister Godfrey Kabianga says government hasn't stopped anyone from talking about poisoning in the country. Yes, he says no, we haven't stopped anyone from talking about, you know, poisoning in the country. But he says what they don't want as government is speaking anyhowly without evidence of what you're talking about. Nobody has stopped anyone from talking about poison or poisoning in the country. You can't stop people and nobody has stopped anyone from talking about poisoning in the country. But I think what is happening is you shouldn't talk about poisoning in a relation with someone whose post-mortem report is very clear. Well, he also said it's very important to summon those people so that we can come to a conclusion of this matter and, if possible, there can be exhuming of Jacob Olanya's body for another post-mortem. <laughs> That is all. Now, we are all questioning that what could be the cause of all this poisoning? If indeed it's happening in our country, why would someone wake up one morning to poison some other person? <laughs> Well, there you go. That is one of the doctors right here in Kampala and she says there is too much unemployment which has caused people to start killing each other. And personally, I think government need to do something about the too much unemployment in Uganda so that we can avoid such cases of poisoning and others happening in our country. I don't know what you think, but of course the comment section is right there for you. You can put your comment and most importantly, subscribe to the Buzz UG in case you haven't and also tap on the bell for all the notifications. Thank you.